Hello friends, today we are in Alisha's bedroom. Look at her clock. There are 60 markings around the face of the clock. Each mark shows a minute. The minute hand moves from one mark to the next in one minute. There are 60 minutes in one hour. Remember, one day is equal to 24 hours. One hour is equal to 60 minutes. And one minute is equal to 60 seconds. Now, we will learn how to read and write the quarter past and quarter to time. Let's begin with quarter past. When the minute hand is at 3 and the hour hand is a little after 10, we say that the time is quarter past 10 or 10.15. We write it as quarter past 10 or 10 colon 1 5. The clock is showing a different time now. The minute hand is at 3 and the hour hand is a little after 2. We say that the time is quarter past 2 or 2.15. We write it as quarter past 2 or as 2 colon 1 5. Now, let's learn quarter 2. Look, the minute hand is at 9 and the hour hand is a little before 10. We say that the time is quarter to 10 or 9.45. We write it as quarter to 10 or as 9 colon 4 5. See, the clock is showing a different time now. Here also, the minute hand is at 9, but the hour hand is a little before 3. We say that the time is quarter to 3 or 2.45. We write it as quarter to 3 or as 2 colon 4 5. Oh, it was so nice to learn quarter past and quarter to with Alicia's clock.